All right, what's going on, guys? So it is 5:20 already. Um, I pre-ordered from Square this game, Dragon Guard 3, about four months ago already. I think it was January or February, um, maybe late December. I don't remember. Uh, but I was tipped off to this game from a fellow YouTuber and um, went and picked it up. Luckily, there were a few left. There was only uh, 5,000 copies of this actual collector's edition made. And I believe this was... I believe it was 70... It was either 79 or 74.99. But it does come with a uh, close to 200 page uh, novel book. It comes with... Um, well, they, they actually say it comes with premium packaging, but <laughs> the packaging does look nice. Underneath this outer sleeve, there is um, more, you know, like it shows there, a detailed picture. Then it comes with a few uh, posters. It's got a, a reversible side poster. I guess that's cool, but I don't really, I don't know. I just have two of them. And then included on this disc, there's some um, DLC, a prequel stage DLC, and some other stuff. Um, these three bonuses, they did, Square released um, those bonuses kind of um, unorthodox. As the pre-order went along, they announced what, the pre what these were with the collectors. Yet there was only 5,000 collector's editions, and you knew they were all going to sell out right away. Yet they timed the release of these D of um, DLC or whatever. They, they were, you know, waiting to tell you what it was, almost as if to entice you later on to buy it. Which is just, I don't know, it just seemed kind of weird to me. So it does come with, you know, the soundtrack too. I don't know much about Dragon Guard 3. Uh, I'm looking into it more now, kind of checking out the lore of it. Um, will I play this? I don't know. Like I've mentioned before, I know I haven't thrown that many videos up lately or been talking much about my collection, but um, for those of you who don't know, my Blu-ray and my PS3 does not work. So I'm very limited to what I can actually play for PS3. Currently, I just finished playing... Um, well, I completed Dark Souls um, 2 a few times, and then I wanted to download Dark, Dark Souls, but it's disc only. They don't even have it on the PSN, so I am playing Demon Souls now, um, so I can't even play Dark Souls until I get a new uh, PlayStation 3. I'm not going to bother fixing mine. I'm not going to risk all the information I have on there. So, okay, well... That's it. If I wanted to chat anymore, I'd probably come in front of the camera, but just wanted to show this. Um, I don't know, you know, I, if I really do want to play this, I'll probably buy another copy. I don't know if I want to leave this closed or not. You know, like I, le I left my uh, Bravely Default sealed. So, you know, I left that sealed. I'll hold on to that for a while. Um, you know, maybe sell it to somebody who wants it sealed one day, or maybe just hold on to it forever. I kind of like having a... I got this uh, sealed square collection going now with uh, Dragon Guard 3, and I still actually have a copy of uh, The Witch and the Hundred Knights sealed, but that is from NIS. So who knows, I might just start a sealed square collection, but just something about sealed games, I don't really, it just doesn't entice me. I want to play the game, I want to look at all the artwork that comes in there. Um, so, yeah, that's it. Um, there is some pretty good... Uh, playthroughs, not entire playthroughs obviously, but uh, some of the opening sequences and stuff of this game on YouTube if you want to go check it out. I recommend going and watching the intro for this. It's pretty cool. Uh, it seems just like a very, just a very adult game. Um, there's a lot of death and killing in there, and as you can see, it's got that classic Final Fantasy artwork to it. So if you, if you liked Final Fantasy 13 um, and all the X's or whatever, um, or the 13, or what, you know, all the, whatever, those three games that came out. Yeah, I think you'll really like this game. Uh, the artwork's on par, and it doesn't look like something that was just scrapped together from the remains of Final Fantasy. It looks like they actually put some work into this game and uh, polished it up a bit. So, uh, it is uh, straight up um, 
action, and I don't know how much RPG element is in there. All I know is that it's just a lot of action. So, yeah, that's it, guys. And uh, I, I did shoot um, my T-shirt collection vid, but it was a little dark in here, so I'm gonna reshoot that. I'm got a, quite a few shirts now, so look for that soon. All right, guys. I'll talk to you later. Peace.